What's up my beautiful people? Welcome back to my channel. It's Lizzie Atkins here as always. <laughs> Thank you for staying with me on my beautiful journey and to my new viewers who have just clicked on this video I do hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope it's convincing enough for you to join the family because I would love to have you join my family. Thank you. Why do you think you're never getting that same browse like your favourite YouTuber? If you want to find out, keep watching the video. Now listen, there are over, over 10 different shapes of brows. There is rounded low arch, rounded medium arch, rounded high arch, soft angled low arch, soft angled medium arch, soft angled high arch, hard angled flat S shape. Let's be real, this S shape looks like a um, spam and we've got the straight high arch we all know that our faces are shaped and sized in different ways the different shapes of our face are oval round long squared hard and diamond Knowing the shape of your face will help you determine the shape of your eyebrows. For oval shaped faces, soft angles and shallow arches are the best. For round faces, a lifted angled arch. For a long face, a flat eyebrow. For a square face, a strong brows with a defined arch. For a hot shaped face, high arches are best. For a diamond shaped face, rounded brows are the best. What eyebrow shapes are the most attractive? Let's be real, every eyebrow shape is nice. It looks good depending, like I said, depending on the shape of your face, your eyebrow will look good. But personally for me, I'm not even gonna lie, the S shaped brow looks a bit funny still. I'm not, I, I haven't seen it on anyone else and I'm hoping not to see it on anyone, so yeah. Choosing an eyebrow colour. Your hair, the colour in your hair determines the colour of your brows. Okay? The darker you are, slightly lighter you should go. The lighter you are, the slightly darker you should go. You can use brow powder, a brow pencil or a pomade which is also known as a brow gel to achieve your perfect brows. Using a brow powder helps give your brows a softer, more natural look and using a pencil is great for filling like spaces on your brows. That's if you've got spaces to fill or if you literally have nothing like me, girl, go get your pencil and you can also use the gel as well. Thank you for watching today's video. I hope I was able to help you understand more about your brows and knowing the shape of your face as well as matching the right shape of brows to your face to give the our brows that wow factor that we've always been looking for. If you've enjoyed this video thoroughly, do not forget to give this video a massive thumbs up and if you do give the video a thumbs down, please do let me know in the comment down below why you have given my video a thumbs down. I would like to hear from you. For now, do stay blessed and I'll see you in my next video. This shop uh, uh, for about uh, 